Hello everyone and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. I know, I know, I'm sorry, it's been a long time since I made a video on this, but do you remember when we landed on the moon in the first episode? Uh, I remember that. <laughs> in case you don't remember that, you can go back and watch it if you want. But either way, we got three guys on the moon. I don't think they actually have enough power to get back to uh, Earth, back to Kerbin. So I was thinking maybe what we'd do today is we'd send a ship up there with them. And perhaps, I don't know, we might be able to meet up with them or something like that. But what we'll definitely do is we'll try and put a rover on the moon. I don't really know how to do that, okay? I don't know how rovers work. I saw one video on it, and I'm gonna try and, like, replicate what that guy did. So hopefully it works, and hopefully we can make something that can get these guys home again. Okay, so the first thing we have to do if we're gonna build a rover is we have to make a little structural body on it. Uh, they do have this rove mate that, like... You know, we'll, we'll give you a little body so you can start. I guess we could use that. We need to put some wheels on it, basically. We need to make it drive around. I'm not exactly sure if this is the best way to do it, but this is probably the easiest way. So then you got these things called wheels here, you know? You know, these wheels things? They don't actually uh, line up properly, so it's going to be hard. You got to take off symmetry now. You got to you gotta put the sim... Holy shit, I don't need this many wheels. Please stop. There. Oh, it's looking good so far. Okay, you got three wheels on there. Nothing's gone wrong no so far. Nothing's blown up yet because nothing can blow up yet. So yeah Just bear with me here now. You could do a rover that uh, Drives itself with some fancy technology But I'm actually gonna put a seat in this thing so that we can drive it ourselves with our Kerbins or our Kerbals or whatever the hell they're called I don't know what the hell I'm doing guys But it kind of looks like something that might work at some point Bring it over. For, there you go, like this. Look, it looks like a bug or something. It's so adorable. It's totally gonna work. This thing is gonna suck so bad. I'm just gonna throw that out there now, okay? Let's stick some solar panels on there, and maybe, just maybe, in some way, shape, or form, this thing will work. I don't know. You're gonna need batteries as well. We'll put the batteries on the side, okay? There. We got solar panels. We gotta put some batteries there. I think it's gonna be, like, the, the best thing ever, okay? This thing doesn't know what it's doing. Like, it, it goes all funny on me. It doesn't look right. See, it doesn't, it doesn't like connect properly. I don't even care. You're going on there, you look good to me. Someone's gonna sit on there and they're gonna drive around and they're gonna have a great time. Okay, I'm pretty sure this thing I just put on here that's highlighted, I think that will allow me to drive it around and test it out. Let's just see. Oh, oh, we got a launch. We got a launch. I don't know, I heard these things don't actually work on Earth. I don't know why. But, uh, look at it. <gasps> oh, it's working. Okay, backwards and forwards are messed up, but it works. It actually works. <laughs> okay, all right, that's the first step done. Look at it. Look at it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna name him Buggy because he looks like a bug. Nee. This is gonna be so awesome. When we put it on the moon. Turn the lights on. Where are the lights at? Woo! Now we're talking. <laughs> now this thing, I think, needs to be on the other side because it's pointing in the wrong direction. Can we just rotate it, maybe? There we go. Okay, okay, we got it now. Woo! <laughs> all right. All right, it's driving in the right direction, so this is the direction we need to put the guy in, okay? And he's gonna drive around the moon, he's gonna go all kinds of fast speeds. 14 and a half meters per second, 50, 16 meters per second! How fast can this thing even go? 18? 19? Oh man, this thing is gonna haul ass on the moon, I'm telling you right now. Oh yeah! I guess what we need to do next is we need to make some kind of, we, we can take that off, that doesn't need to be there anymore. We need to make a thing that'll actually um, lower this down to the moon, okay? This thing is really complicated, you need to use some really weird structural parts, but apparently if you put a piece on, that's a pretty big piece, that's a pretty big piece right there. You gotta put some, oh no one is bigger, you gotta put some kind of piece on. I don't know if I can do this or not, but I'm gonna put a decoupler on here, because if you put a decoupler on here, it will uh, detach from your vehicle and your vehicle will look great. If you don't do that, you're gonna have some issues, I think. So, yeah. We could probably put a two-person thing on here. We could put two people in here if we wanted. We could put another one of those things on. We're gonna do that. I don't know if that's a good idea or not, but we're gonna try it. This thing right here, it may look like a life-saving device, but it's actually a toroidal fuel tank, okay? I don't know. That's something you need to do. You need to put one of those on there, and you need to put some of those, um, some of those engines on, and everything's gonna be fine, okay? Okay, Buggy, are you ready for this, buddy? You should be able to go forwards. Okay, okay, hang on, hang on. I didn't put the I didn't put the lights on the right side. You have lights in your ass now. That's not a big deal. That's not a big deal. We should be able to fire. It's not really working that well. Um, and the fuel's gone. Great. Um, that was that was lovely. Thanks. Thanks for that. But it comes off. Look at that. It actually comes off properly. We need we have a little decoupler left, but that's fine. It's not a big deal. The coupler can stay. Unless we flip it. Can we flip it? 
If this thing is flipped, it should technically come off completely, right? Oh shit, wrong button. Whoa, look at it go! Okay, so this thing can kind of use fuel. <laughs> it is out of here. See you later, bitches. But seriously, come back. I think this guy needs some more fuel cells. That's what I think he needs. Look at that. Look at that on the back. Look at that ass now. That actually looks kind of cool, okay? His ass looks kind of cool. And now we just need to, um... I don't know, I feel like we need to add more fuel in here just to make sure that the stuff works properly. Okay, I've decided to change everything, guys. I may have another way to... Oh, these things are really big. Maybe not. Maybe this won't work. Can I just get a little tiny one here somewhere? Can I get a little tiny, uh... Little tiny thing? I guess this is what the little tiny thing is. I don't think I can get much smaller than that. Everything else is gigantic. Damn it. Uh, what about something like this, huh? What about something with a bunch of fuel on it like that? It may be really heavy, but I don't care. What do you got for us here? You drive forwards. You drive backwards. Good stuff. What happens if I turn on your engines? Oh! Oh, it's going up in the air! It is making it up in the air! And then when you detach, the thing goes on, and you fall to the ground and die. I like it. I like this, and I think it's gonna work. Okay, Buggy, I think you are ready to go to the next step here. I'm not completely sure, okay? But we're gonna do it. We're gonna attach some more stuff to you, and we're gonna send you to space. We're gonna get you to the moon, to the other guys so they can ride around. I don't know if we'll have any way to actually get them home again, but that's not important when you got your own moon rover, okay? Let's just do it. Honestly, guys, I'm gonna be kind of sad because this guy looks like he's wearing a hat right now, and I think it's kind of awesome, and he's gonna have to lose the hat if he wants to actually uh, ride around on the ground. I mean, technically, he doesn't have to lose his hat. He could keep it on, but then people wouldn't be able to get in it. I don't know, man. It's a lose-lose situation or something. This is honestly really bare bones. I didn't even bother to put any fuel lines in here or any struts or any of the things you'd normally put in there that are probably important. But I'm, I'm kind of confident that we can do it anyway because we just can't, okay? Shut up. So we're in space. Everything is really quiet. I don't know why. There's no music on. Maybe I'm not hot. Oh, here we go. We got some music. Okay, this is the moon over here, in case you didn't already know. And uh, I think I'm going to try and use this thing here. I don't even know what it is. I'm doing some kind of weird maneuver thing, and it's going to bring me to the moon. I don't know. I'm bare bones in this, because that's what I do, because I don't really know what I'm doing in this game. So apparently I have to burn here, okay? I'm going to burn a little bit right here and see what happens. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. What's going on? What's going on? Why aren't you? Why aren't you? Go! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Everything got screwed up. I don't know why, but it wouldn't actually do what it was supposed to do, and now we're just flying around in space. Look at this shit. It sucks, okay? Mmm, yeah. Put on some liquid fuel there, Matt. That's a great idea. Everybody needs the liquid fuel. No, they don't. You're an idiot. Put on the right stuff next time. You'll do better. Look what I did. Oh, it's gonna work. I'm way the hell over here, and the moon is supposed to be coming for me, but it's not doing a very good job, so you better freaking hurry up, moon. I'll, I'll go a thousand, per, thousand times or whatever to help you get here. Oh, God. You're taking a long time. Why are you taking so long? I need you, moon. Crap. I think I, I think I screwed something up here. Moon, don't leave me! When will we see each other again? Okay, you see that? Do you see that beautiful, beautiful rock coming into view here? Oh, we're gonna meet up with it. <laughs> yeah, we are. Uh-huh. And then we're gonna try and land somewhere near it. It's gonna be good. Okay, look. We got a new orbit. This is it, guys. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. You see that little dot down there? That is where we need to go. That is where our carbons are. And, uh, and it's gonna be, it's gonna be hard to do. Because we don't even have much fuel left. We're gonna have to start using the other thing. So I'm just gonna start burning, okay? Start burning. See how much fuel we can get out of this thing. Maybe all of it. That'd be nice. Oh, we may do it. Yeah, okay. A little bit further. Add a girl. Add a girl. She's gonna give it any second. Oh, look, we did it! Okay. Boom! The map says that we're now gonna land just a little bit away from it. I don't know how much a little bit is, because these are kilometers we're talking here. But we got, like, we got this thing by itself now. We can actually just pop it off, but I'm worried that we're gonna... Run into problems with that. Hold on one second. What we'll do is we'll um we'll quit quick save for one. We always quick save. Okay, that's something that I learned. Quick save your shit all the time. Pro grade. We're gonna turn pro grade and we're gonna pop off, okay? We're gonna we're gonna fuel a little bit forwards. Now we're gonna pop off. Oh shit, stop, stop, cut 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 that out. Jesus, you don't need to do that. Who do you think you are? Oh crap. Can we not turn? Oh crap. Wait, maybe if we do a little bit of a fuel a little bit, and now we should be able to turn. Turn to where we need to go. There we go, okay. Okay, retrograde, please. We don't have SAS on this thing. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. 
Oh shit, this is this is bad. This is bad. Please stop. Please, please, please. Whatever you're doing, don't do it like that. Oh shit. Oh shit. Good thing we got quick saves. Woo! Just land. We're not gonna land this thing, are we? I feel like we almost could. Just touch the ground. Ah, oh, it blew up. Wait, we're still going. We're still going. Look at this thing. Look, land. Land, land, you should land. You should totally land here. Come on, catch. Oh, oh, come on, buggy. You can do it, buggy. You can do it, buggy. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good. We're going into a crater, guys. We are going into a crater right now. Oh, oh, we're getting some, oh, sh we had some traction. We're stopped. We're slowing down. Just land right side up. Please land right side up. We don't even have a, crap. I don't think we have anything to control this thing. We're gonna need to get our Kerbals over here. I don't know if we can do that very easily. I can try it. They're only 11 kilometers. Away. Jesus Christ! So we spent a lot of money on Buggy, okay? We spent a lot of money on him, and he wasn't good enough because he didn't have a freaking reaction wheel, I think. We need to just throw a reaction wheel on there, and everything will be fine then, right? Maybe, I don't know. Just throw a reaction wheel there. <gasps> oh man, look at that. Look at him go. Look at how fast he can spin. I mean, we are in like four times speed, but still, look, he can actually spin now. He can rotate. That means that Buggy can actually do his job. I think, I think we might actually be able to get this guy on the moon, guys. Oh, it's gonna happen. It is gonna happen now. Woohoo! There we go. Slow it down. That's the good stuff. There we go. That's nice. Okay. Now we're gonna pop off. Okay. And we're just gonna slow ourselves down again. Look at that. Oh, it's so nice. It's gonna work. Yeah, okay, okay. You hear those noises? Those are good noises. Look at me! Look at me spinning in the air! It's amazing, it works! Oh! oh everything I ever dreamed of is coming true right now. More quick saving, please. I see you, Iron Maiden. You are so close to me. Up on that hill over there. Sort of a hill, I don't know what it is. Look how close we are to the ground! We're landing this thing! The wheels are spinning, everything is going well. Just gonna cancel out the velocity. Oh, 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 don't, don't. Don't screw up. We can actually drive this thing over now as well. We don't even need to, uh, we don't need to pop anything off here. We can drive it over first. We can technically leave it on as long as we want it, but we won't be able to put the guys on there. Look at that. Oh, we touched down. Oh, nope, nope, nope. We need, we need to not do that. Shit, shit. Flip, 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 flip. Flip, flip it over. Okay, take off the SAS. Stability assist, please. That was a bit of a problem. And we are there. Whew. Okay, now, here's the thing. We need to put on docking mode, okay, so we can actually get some uh, some driving going on here. Look at these little wheels. Look at them go. Okay, we're driving over. <laughs> oh, this is wonderful. Look at it go. We're there. We are there. We're a few hundred meters away. Look at that. We should probably slow down a little bit. Oh. Low gravity, man. Low gravity. Low Jesus. Nope. 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 No. 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 It's time to load our quick save. Not cool. Wait. Wait, everything is fine. Everything is fine. Stop, 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 stop. Roll over again. Roll over, buggy. Oh, crap. He's not going to want to roll over now, is he? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Okay. Now, we just need to knock this thing over, right? I've tried to do this before. I remember, like, way back in the day, I had an episode where I tried to do this, and it didn't really work. But if we fly at it really fast, should do the job. Okay. Not so much. Not, not as good as I hoped it would be. Oh, oh, damn it. It's so close to flipping over. Yes, turn it that way. That's the good stuff. There we go. Jump. Yes, flip over. Damn it. Thank you very much. And please don't leave. I need to get on you. There we go. Oh, I'm on. Board. Board that shit. Yes. Yes, we did it. We are on the rover. It's not working. Yes, it is. It is working. <laughs> we did it. I finally did it. We need a good picture. Come on, we need a good thumbnail here, bud. You gotta turn your face towards the sun. Get the good side of you. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at him. That is just plain beautiful. Look at Buggy. Buggy the Rover. I love it. Now we just gotta drive back and show all our friends. Because we can get two people on here if we want. We can have two people. We can go extra, extra good because two people is better than one. Two is better than one in most situations. Except when you have SCDs. Then you're probably better off having none. Okay, we got one guy outside here. We're going to take the other guy, Bob. We're going to take him out. Okay, he's going to hop off. He's going to start doing some flying in a minute when he when he decides to. There you go. Okay, now fly over here and get on. It's a two-person vehicle. I made it that way for a reason. There you go. Board it. Board it, baby. Cannot board a seat while standing still. Stop standing still or whatever. There. Okay. 
Now look at it. Look, we got two guys in here now. <laughs> and we got lights. Oh, man. Oh, we got earth in the back and everything. Look at that. Look at that. That is beautiful. You guys. You guys are the stars of this show. Okay, you guys are just going to back up here and we're going to get one more picture, okay? Because you look really freaking happy. Keep that smile on your face for another minute or two, okay? Then you can go back to hating me. There we go. Snap, snap. It's beautiful. And that, guys, is where I'm going to end this video. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Kerbal Space Program. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.